Hey there guys, what's up, it's your boy Vizhov, back with another YouTube video for you guys on the channel. Today's video is going to be us doing a Funko Pop mystery box unboxing. So this is my first one I have ever ordered. Obviously again, shout out to Top Pops on YouTube, a link to them will be in the description down below once more. But give me the idea of getting this, this has been shipped to me from Australia. I ordered it from Australia. I had to bait all on it, but I should be getting the money back for that hopefully. So uh, yeah, let's, without further ado, let's get right into the video. Right then guys, I can't wait to open this. All that I know is that it's video game themed and that six random Funkos in this box. I'm gonna quickly move it, even though it's fucking huge, so we can get into it. What's the best, I mean, I, I want to, ideally I want them to be upside down, just so I don't know which ones they are and I can pull them out from the bottom. Oh, this is hype. I've been waiting, what, two weeks for this? But yeah, I mean, delivery is quick and fast, like really well done. And it was on sale as well, like it was reduced. So if you guys want to get one for yourselves, obviously I'll leave the link to Pop Culture in the description down below so you guys can also get them yourselves. But it's this, oh, okay, we've got a box in a box. How fun is that? But yeah, we basically just got a box in a box. Eh. Right, I might have to tip this. I just wonder why there's so much packaging. So basically what you guys can see here is it says Funko Limited Company from Vietnam. Well, obviously I think they've been factory, fa like manufactured in Vietnam. Item number there, six uh, Funko Pops, obviously six pieces per case. So yeah, I'm gonna get, again, open it from the bottom. Cause like I said, I don't wanna know who they are off the bat. I don't want to give a genuine reaction. As you guys know, I love doing genuine reactions. I hope they're all upside down as well, not one the wrong way up if you guys know what I mean. Okay, it's not all video game themed. There's a couple of videos, but this is um, the right way up. Oh, fudge. Okay, let me quickly flip it. I almost messed that up, chat uh, comments. I almost messed that up. Obviously, if there's ones in there that I don't want, I can always sell them, but yes. They're all now the wrong way around. So what I'm gonna do, am I cut into that box? Or is that from the, no, I haven't cut into it. Damn, thank God. I'm gonna do it random, right? I'm gonna pick one out and then I'll show it to you guys. Obviously, I've got literally no room. I haven't seen it yet. I haven't seen it yet. Crash Bandicoot, that's really good. Oi! We got a fake Crash Bandicoot. Damn, that one looks sick. That looks sick. What do you guys think in the comments? Let me know. That looks sick. Let me have a quick look at the price of this one using the Funko app. I'm actually quite interested in this. So this one is worth nine bucks. So this one on its own is worth nine dollars if you were to buy it in the store. So yeah, so far, like I said, I spent with whole about 55 euros on the actual six piece. So if we can make our money back, that'd be dope. But for the first one, Fake Crash Bandicoot is dope. I used to play with Crash Bandicoot as a kid growing up. So that's an awesome one to get. Next one, gonna uh, pick them as they go, is a Fallout Funko. And it is, who's that? Power Armor Unmasked. Oi, this one looks pretty decent, you know? It comes with the whole like attire, comes with like a sword as well. Obviously without the mask. Let's have a quick look on the Funko app and see how expensive this one would be. Again, this one would be nine bucks. So again, it's not really, not really making any money, but this one is also again, nine bucks. We're up to 18 bucks right now, just on the two right there. Get the third one out. We're halfway already into the video. I've already seen, oh, I've just seen this by accident. Whoa, it's a gold special edition, Handsome Jack from Borderlands 3. Oh, this is sick. How much is this? Oh, I'm nervous now, chat. No oh, comment, sorry. How much are you saying? What's your predict? Get your predictions in the comments down below. But yeah, I'm scanning it now. Ooh, cheeky little $15. $15 for this one. That's 18, that's what? 28, $33 we're at now on if we were to list these. So let's get on to the fourth one. The fourth one is from Assassin's Creed. Who is it? It's Callum Lynch. Okay, I don't know Assassin's Creed because I never really played it, but it is Callum Lynch from Assassin's Creed. It looks quite nice though. I can't really say it doesn't look nice. It's just one that I've, it's just a, a game I've never really played and B, it's not one that I'd necessarily want in my collection, if you know what I mean. Let's have a look at how expensive this one would be. I'm predicting nine bucks again. Seven. Ooh, okay. So what, we were at 30, so what's that? 18 and 15 is 33. So we're at $40 right now, 40 bucks. Not too shabby. We could make our money back if we hit another jackpot, but we've got two left. Let's hope the last two are good. We've had the special edition though. I've, I managed to get a special edition. I'm very surprised. Right, penultimate one. It's an 8-bit. It's an 8-bit Funko. It's a bit heavier. Oh my Lord. A werewolf from Altered Beast, the werewolf in 8-bit. Very, very nice. Get your price predictions in the comments, please. I want to see what this one's worth. I'm predicting just 10 bucks. $8. Yeah, that's what I thought. So we're up to 80, what's that, 48 bucks? I don't think we're going to make our money back, but um, yeah, I mean, we could, we could either break even or we could make plus one if the next one's 8 bucks. But yeah, this is quite nice. 
This is really nice. I really like, let me know in the comments if you guys like the look of this one. It's like I said, 8-bit. And you guys know I don't ever unpack my Funkos purely because if I don't, if I do want to resell them, whatever, and get better value for it. Last one of the video is another Assassin's Creed one. Ooh, okay. Okay, it's another Assassin's Creed. It's Mar Maria? Would you say Maria to that? I think it's you'd say Maria to that. But yes, uh, Assassin's Creed Maria. If this is eight bucks, we we make plus one. If anything below that, we either break even or lose money. Ah, fudge! It's six bucks. So we've made we've made minus one. So we've actually lost one dollar on the whole thing. So yeah, I mean. All in all, I can't really complain because they are really, really, really nice fun guys, if I'm honest. You got, what, what did we get? Two Assassin's Creed, a gold uh, Handsome Jack Borderline one, uh, special edition, Crash Bandicoot. Yeah, I mean, out of these six, like I said, for the, for the price I paid, if we take Toll off, that'd be 44. And we made, what, 54? I made 10 bucks if we take Toll off. So yeah, I'm happy with that. Let me know in the comment se section down below if you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys have, please make sure to hit the like button, subscribe if you're not already, and I'll see you guys in my next video very, very soon. Peace.